Uh, it was a great experience. Uh, I mean, you can't really ask for more in baseball. I mean, that's all our plan are every day. We go in and uh, compete and win every game we can and uh, hopefully get a chance at the playoffs. And we just had good enough teams and great enough pitching and uh, our coaching staff was real great. So, I mean, it was just a good experience to go out and uh, win the last two years. Yeah, for majority of the part, actually, it was like the same same team. That's kind of rare. Usually, they kind of we start like splitting up. Some team, some players get moved up, and some get sent down. But it was really good. We had the same group of guys, so we knew knew what to expect from players, and and the coaching staff too actually went up with us too. Um, I worked a little bit, had a job, so I kind of mixed in my workouts. I would usually hit every single day and work out around three to four times a, a week. Um, I would say I kind of got a, just a old school style of play. I kind of play the game hard and play it the right way, kind of do anything for the team. And uh, I like to drive in runs and just play hard. No, I actually didn't know anything really about independent ball. So I actually called a lot of my my like ex teammates and ex like players that I've known played in the league and stuff like that. So I had to call around and uh, ask favors and ask ask uh, the down low on all the teams and stuff like that. Um, growing up, I just I kind of hated to strike out, and I really had a good eye, even at a young age. I I always said that my eye would like play well higher up I go because I knew the strike zone. I knew what I wanted to swing at and what I didn't want to swing at. So I kind of always had that growing up and it kind of started to play better when I got to pro ball. Uh, defense is really important. I mean, that's the way to keep on playing. I think in, in most people's eyes, I mean, if you can defend and stuff like that, they'll find a spot for you. I mean, I've always been able to hit, and so taking that next step to be able to field, I kind of converted. I was a third baseman right fielder in college, and then my senior year I played a little bit of first, and then I got drafted, and they just moved me straight to first base, and so it was a learning experience. But I uh, came off and started to learn how to play first base really well and kind of have to give all the credit to all my coaches teaching me the, the, the position and how to play around the bag. Um, I never really had that. I didn't really think about it until you just said it. Um, I, I knew a couple of guys with the Cubs, and I thought maybe that was a chance that I was getting drafted, but maybe they just liked the way I went about the game and played it the right way, and uh, maybe my eye had to play it because they were really into that and uh, analytics of baseball, so maybe that had something to do with it. Yeah, I do, because the umpire called it a double. They said it, it hit off the top of the wall and came back. I was like, I want to say I was like seven or six years old, and I hit a home run in double A. And uh, my everybody knew it was a home run but the umpire. So I ended up getting a double. So really, I guess it wasn't an official home run, but in my eyes, it was my first home run. Yeah, just a little bit. You guys probably uh, – I'm not used to snow, but I went out and played ball in North Carolina, and it had like little snow flurries where it barely stuck on the car, and that's the most, that's the, yeah, that's the most snow I've seen. So no, I haven't. I was kind of I've been watching your guys's like uh, feeds and stuff like that, where the fields like all snowed and stuff like that. And so I was like, it's gonna be cold up there, and I love the cold. So playing in the cold is a little different than than uh, liking the cold. But I, I enjoy being cold and hot. I don't I don't consider myself a Florida. Florida because when it gets above like 75, 80, I think it's too hot. I love fishing. Uh, it's my main hobby. I like golfing with my brother and my dad. So that's one of the main, main two hobbies I like doing. Kind of just hanging out with friends and stuff like that too. Going and watch like sporting events and stuff like that. Anything kind of outdoors. I, I like being outdoors and doing anything new. But fishing's probably, fishing and golf are probably my two main hobbies. I uh, kind of experienced what uh, Canada has to offer. I've only been to Canada for a couple of days and never had my own vehicle or anything like that. So I didn't really know where to get around. And I was in the opposite part of Canada. I was in um, 
Yeah, it was Vancouver. We played Vancouver for a small series when I was with Boise, Idaho. They were in our division, so that's the only part of Canada I've ever been in, and it was kind of cool. It was right by all the thing, but I didn't really get the experience because we were only there for five days. 